A quick disclaimer before this video starts. This video is for educational purposes only. I do not recommend buying fakes. I don't wear fakes. None of that. Stay away from fakes, but this video is for educational purposes only. Enjoy. Soul Premise makes the best high quality bags for sneakerheads when you travel. Every Soul Premise bag holds your sneakers. They're made to hold your sneakers. TSA approved, very affordable, all different colors, all different types of bags, backpacks, duffel bags. They even have new suitcases as well. Make sure you guys check out Soul Premise. The link is down below in the description and use my discount code Danny Moore to save you 40% off your order from soulpremise.com. Thank you Soul Premise for sponsoring this video. I absolutely love my Soul Premise backpacks. The Air Jordan 1 is one of the most faked sneakers ever. So in this video, we're going to unbox one of the best fake Air Jordan 1s I've ever seen. Let's get straight into this unboxing. I'm excited to see these even though they're fake. I want to see how good or how bad these sneakers truly are. So they do come all wrapped up here. Cut this open. FedEx little wrapping. Come all double boxed just like this. Let's open this up. And let's see what fake sneakers I got here. When it comes to Jordan 1s, there's so many fakes because Jordan 1s are just very popular and people just don't want to spend the money on them for whatever reason. Let's take a look. Let's see how good or bad these are. And we will do a little comparison to the real pair. And then stay tuned. I'll do a full in-depth video of the real versus fake. So let's open these up. We got the box. This is a size nine shiny jordan one box if you guys know this box you know what sneaker this is they do have a stamp first of all there's a very strong odor coming from the sneaker already and here are the shoes the bread patent leather air jordan one yeah these are one of the best fake sneakers i've ever seen jordan one wise absolutely now the shape is off there on the back there is some differences i am noticing right away not bad for a fake sneaker, not awful. Not great, because they are fake, but not awful at the end of the day. They do come with the hang tag, and this has some weight to it. Yeah, there's definitely some differences I am noticing, but overall, here is a look at the fake pair of bread patent leather Air Jordan 1s. Very highly anticipated sneaker. A lot of people want this shoe, and that resale price is a little high, so people are going ahead and cop the fake version. I don't understand it. If you cop fakes, leave a comment down below. Let me know why you do that. Here is a look at the Nike Air on the tongue. So here's a look at the sneaker. I'll do a full 360 to show you guys every little detail that I possibly can on these. They are off. There are some things I am noticing that are different. They do come with the extra red laces attached as well. You do have family there on the inside. The font is off from what I'm noticing. There are some stitching errors. Shape is off, but overall, on feet, I think it'll be tough to tell. And no one's gonna come up to you and say, yo, those are fake. No one's gonna be doing that. I don't condone fakes. I don't buy fakes. I don't recommend buying fakes. Stay away from fakes. But I did it for, of course, for content for you guys. I don't pay for these sneakers. So let's take a look at a real pair right here. There are some differences that I am noticing to start off. The red is slightly different. There are some differences. Stay tuned, I'll do a full in-depth comparison real versus fake here on these but overall they're close and on feet i think it's gonna be even harder to tell but yeah man these are the fake bread patent leather air jordan ones would you wear these leave a comment let me know let me know what you guys think about these down below in the comments man real versus fake coming this has got to be one of the best fake jordan ones i've ever seen they're close they're off but they're close and it's kind of scary out there when you want to be getting this the real deal and you don't want to get scammed on the fake so make sure you guys stay tuned for that video let me know down below in the comments what do you think about these fake bread patent leathers jordan ones do you think that these look close just off the video if you have a real pair do they look close leave a comment let me know real fake this is scary guys this is crazy watch out this has got to be one of the best fake Air Jordan 1s I've ever seen. Free bread patent leather Air Jordan 1 giveaway. Of course, the authentic pair. All you guys need to do is hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below. Let me know your size in the bread patent leather Air Jordan 1s. Black light test time. You guys can use the link down below in the description. Go cop yourself a black light. It'll help you with legit checks. So let's go ahead and black light test these. I'm looking for any stamps or any marks that shouldn't be there, any factory stamp or anything like that. 
So far, I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing any Chinese stamps or anything like that here on the sneaker. Let me take a look at the other one. But now we got the right shoe. Once again, I'm not seeing any marks at all. And the white stitching is lighting up as you guys can see. I'm not seeing any stamps or anything that shouldn't be there. So they do pass the black light test as far as like a stamp goes. There's no stamp on these. And the same goes for the box label. I'm not seeing any stamp or anything that shouldn't be there on the box label either. Now here's the 100% authentic pair. And once again, just the white stitching is lighting up. Yeah, the fake pair does pass the black light test. Watch out for that. This is scary close. They do come with the accessories, the jump man, the extra laces. They are a little bit off, but I'll show you guys that in the full in-depth review video comparison video, real versus fake. It's scary. They are patent leather, so I think it's a little bit easier to replicate in comparison to maybe a leather pair. I think these might be a little bit easier. There are things off. They're pretty good fakes nonetheless. Let me know what you guys think about these down below in the comments. Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out Soul Premise. Thank you, Soul Premise, for sponsoring this video. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys join the more family. Hit that subscribe button. Smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop always dropping that fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching. We out.